what's going on 60 similar squad we're back with another ishtar game and this time we're doing a meme build you know i already did the normal one or the well the one that i thought most people would go which is like transcendence with you know the good normal auto attack speed items that are like cans xe aussie shit like that but now i'm gonna go full on attack speed because i think well okay there's two reasons you gain attack speed when you use your uh your your stim with your one your your auto attack like whatever the difference is you gain 40 percent attack speed doing that and i gain 20 percent attack speed for my passive which i will always have because i'm only hitting one person and i only have one person hitting me and if i build silver branch imagine Imagine how much damage I can get when I'm in combat. This land so that's that's the play of this game. From the uh, first item is probably just going to be... Actually, it could just be... Oh, fuck. Hold on. I want it to be Ichival, but I feel like it's it'll be better if I just go Atalanta's. Also, I want to get my one... I want I want or I'm sorry, I want to get my three. But I don't want to not get my two. Whatever, my two sucks. Screw the two. I'm getting two points in my one and one point in my three. And then I press one. This gives me less crit damage. Oh, this is the only one that gives me attack speed. It's pretty dope though. Oh god, I forgot I, I'm supposed to be doing a buff. Whatever, it's fine. I'll get a buff after. <laughs> Shit. How did you do that buff so quick? Uh oh. Uh, I'm like really not scared of you. Yeah, I really am not scared of him. He takes a lot of damage from me. I need my lob autos back. Hurry. Yeah, if you if you have control of the wave, it's really easy to clear the wave with the lob autos. Which is something I'm just now realizing. <clears throat> I will do blue buff. I don't love the fact that I have to get blue buff, but she does seem relatively mana hungry. And I mean, there's a lot of hunters that need blue buff, if we're honest. I now have my ult. He backed, so he probably has something I don't want to fuck with, which he does. It's a full ass Jotuns. I can't auto attack. gonna dash away mm. am I scared of you I don't really think that I am I am however very enticed by an actual item now thank you so I'm going to go... Oh, you know what I just noticed? With no starter items in duel, meme builds are going to be even heavier. Like, they're going to be more meme -y Because you don't have the backbone of always having mannequins or always having, uh, you know, extra buff secure or something like that. You actually have to focus. I think I should be using either my two or I'm, I mean, my volley stim instead of my other one. Oh, I do no damage to you. You're very tanky. Also, my build's not that great, so. Did he just jump in place because he thinks it'll scare me? 
I'm a little too much of a veteran for that kind of shenanigans, J2B. Gonna have to be a little bit better than that. Did I stop his back with that auto? I don't think I did. Alright, let's do this. And then we will get our blue buff. And even though I'm I definitely did lose the early game, mainly because I forgot that buffs existed for a second. Oh my, you angry man. Jumped over the wall and altered me. Can I get my buff, please? Annoying. He has so much cooldown right now. Oh my. Bro, he uses those abilities and it does it chunks like 500 damage off me. His 3 1. A new weapon. All right. My speed buff comes up. And I'm only a little bit behind right now. It's not too bad. Well, actually that's not true. I'm 500 go behind, never mind. Your blue buff up? Is that where you're going? You're waiting for it, huh? Oof. Wow. I cannot believe how much damage he does. <laughs> I wonder if Cuckoo got buffed. Because, geez Louise, that one just hit me for 300 damage. That's too much. Oh my. I did a lot of damage there. I hit all five spears of my ult twice. Because it has 10 tick damage right there. And I still lost that fight. By the way, as you can see, my charge can crit. Because the charge itself crit when I hit him. And the auto attack afterwards crit while I was backflipping. Which is pretty insane. I think Ishtar is one of those gods that's just like aggressively not early game. There's a couple gods like that in this game, but I really feel like Ishtar's early game is pretty ass. Which is fine. I mean... Her late game is really good, so... I can't expect every aspect of a new god to be good. There has to be some downside. And I think Ishtar's is early game. Now, that being said... Most hunters' problem is early game. But, uh... I don't know. I feel like she actually has pretty good clear compared to a lot of hunters. With the, uh, the lob autos. But why am I maxing it too? Such a garbage, a garbage ability. I really should play this game like the two really doesn't exist. Because that's how I feel. And it's not uh, only how I feel, by the way. I, I talked to J2B after the first, first look video and I asked him what he felt of the two and he said it was pretty awful mm, I might be able to win a fight here actually
Okay. Um. I mean, his alt is down. Am I scared if his alt is down? I don't know. I can crit with my three, which is the only thing. Like, uh, if I couldn't crit with my three, I would not at all take this fight, but. Good. I don't know how he tell or how he transformed. I was clearly not paying that much attention because I did not think he could transform. Not that it's that bad. I lived. But still. I should try to pay attention at some point. <laughs> my two is up. Or not my two. My blue is up. They rhyme. Damn. I got that itch of all and all of a sudden my attack speed feels pretty good. All right. Blue down. I'll pick it up. Why not? And silver branch is my next item. Gives me a little bit of pen. Are you going to come to blue? And by blue, I mean red, obviously. Yes, he's going to do it. Oh, I'm so dead, bro. Oh, wait a second. He got a bit greedy there. And my ult did way more damage than he thought it would. My combo, my ult three combo did 700 damage just now. You gotta be a bit more careful, my guy. I'm starting to pump. I am starting to pump. All right, let's see what item you got. I do anything. <clears throat> My attack speed is 2.19, and I only have three items. I probably shouldn't be using my lob if I'm ever fighting him. Actually, I haven't been, have I? I think I've been, uh, I've been conscious enough to not do that, at the very least. Uh-oh. There's an angry frog running at me. Where'd he go? Are you? Why couldn't I hear you doing that? Oh my damage. Holy shit. All right, he did get bull demon, but I'm pretty sure I get his tower. Yeah, I do get his tower. It's weird how that works. He is running at me. You're just going to give up the whole wave? So you can try to take tower? I do not find that to be a good play. Yeah, we're basically even now. I don't, I don't love his play. I don't know. I don't know. 
I think overall, I definitely got ahead off of his play. Like, we traded towers, but I think because he missed a whole minion wave, I think I definitely am the one with the advantage after that that whole thing went down. Because I'm, I'm, what, 200 gold behind it as opposed to the 1,000 that I was? All right, pretty great. Pretty great for me. My next item, just something with crazy high attack speed. Probably gonna be a toxic blade. And he does have a little bit of healing. I mean, he's got a very high regen because of, you know, Kukulin. And he's got serrated edge. And he's got a chalice. There's a bit of healing in there. And with Oboe, I don't need to use an ability to clear, so I can kind of greed my abilities. You better run. Oh, I'm garbage. Ah! Oh, let's go, dude. Let's go. The attack speed buff that I get from just the fact that I uh, have a passive is so important here. Oh, man. Do I get Phoenix off that kill? I think I do. That's another thing with this map is uh, it still needs to be changed, but I think death timers are longer on this map. And the distance between wherever you spawn to the Phoenix, like the Fountain of Phoenix, is also longer. So and then I think last item, I'll just go a basic Kins. It's 25% attack speed, right? 20%. Yeah, I mean, I have 15 Silver Brand stacks. If I get an extra 40% attack speed, I get more Silver Brand stacks. Like, I'm feeling good. And that doesn't even add my passive on. I'm feeling pretty good. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my god, I did 601 damage to myself with the <laughs> with the, the thorns. Holy shit. That's, I did a quarter of my own health to myself. But you got to admit, you got to admit, I do a lot of damage. Even when, like my three did 300 damage there. Just my dash. I didn't have alt up or anything that fight. And he used both relics and I fought into the thorns. And it was still... Closer than he would have liked, for sure. Now, can I get any kind of good buff? Like a red buff or a blue buff? I assume they're down. Oh, they're not. Let's go. Yeah, he's definitely going to get red buff. I could maybe poke him a bit while he's doing it. Maybe a little bit annoying. I don't know if I want Kins or if I want Aussie. Cause he doesn't have any he doesn't have any anti heal, so Aussie seems like it'll be a great play. I am just peppering him right now. Oh my god, look at that titan damage. It really seems like this god is nothing early game and everything late game. All right. Clearly he wants to fight me.
Okay. Hmm. I'm pretty sure you do not live through this. Oh, unless I fucking suck. Okay, it turns out I missed everything, and then he crit me four autos in a row. Unlucky? Hmm. Dude. Yeah, I only hit one sword of my whole ult. And it did 100 damage. Um. I have 1700 HP. I don't know. Kins will do a lot. Aussie will also do so much for me, though. I'm just going to go Kins. I'm going to go Kins. And we'll see. I also think I want speed buff. What does this do in, in duel? Well, it gives you attack speed, too. I thought they removed that. I thought it only gave movement speed. But speed buff gives you attack speed, too. So it's definitely better than any other buff in the game. Um. All right, I gotta fight him. I don't love the fact that I have to fight him. Oh, I am doing a lot of damage to you though. Oh my. Yeah, you're definitely feeling it. That Kins is doing a lot. I'll take the Phoenix. And then I will take your blue buff. And then I will take the XP camp. And then I will back. And I will get both of my fully upgraded relics. <sighs> And when I use my three, I have 45 stacks of silver branch plus the extra 20%, which is going to give me another 10 stacks. So I have 55 stacks of silver branch with this build, which by the way is 110 power. In case you're wondering. I think I'm just going to do this. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh fuck. Oh, no shot, dude. No shot. Holy fuck. That's crazy. Can I win off that? I don't think I can win off that. That bull demon. That bull demon helped a lot. That regen. Too good. Um. Yeah, I definitely cannot win off that. And I, I did 400 damage to myself with thorns still in that fight too. Oh, I'll be sure to use this. Absolutely insane fights. My problem with the fighting though is just it's so easy for him to get close to me. Uh, Red's not up yet. Well, my Phoenix just got up though. Oh my god. Dude, I really don't feel like I should be doing that much damage. Like, I'm full attack speed, bro. My... My autos, even the ones that are supposed to do reduced damage, do so much. <laughs> Yeah, my three did 450 damage and it didn't even crit. So it could have gone up to like 700 just off my three. That's crazy. I actually think I like this build. I like the attack speed build more than I like the real build with transcendence and everything like that. Which is weird because you probably shouldn't like it that much more, but I do. I don't know. I do.
Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, guys. Peace.